Hello guys and welcome to another Profile Tree video. So today we're going to be covering the best Firefox SEO extensions. So without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get started. So first of all, what I want to cover is what exactly is Mozilla Firefox? So just before we're looking into the add-ons, Mozilla Firefox is a free and open source web browser that offers a fast and secure web browsing. Now there's at least over 100 million users actively using this browser and has grown over the years to become one of the most popular open source products for the web. So what exactly are Firefox extensions then? Firefox extensions, also known as plugins or add-ons, they're pretty much just like apps for the Firefox browser and it brings a whole new level of functionality to make the user's experience a lot easier when browsing the internet. So an example of this is if a user requires maybe something to do with text to speech so they can multitask or maybe you have a disability um, and you can't see well or you can't hear or whatever it is basically it's very good very good um, even if you're doing powerpoints um, you can have a text to speech sort of um, discussion so that's a handy thing to have especially if you don't want to talk and then you can just have the computer do it for you or the extension or say you wanted to screenshot an entire page you can do so using the extensions as well there's hundreds and hundreds of mozilla extensions that are created for different functionalities by developers and that's why they're there firefox did initially lack from useful plugins back in the day but this has now changed and it's now as good as using Chrome extensions when browsing using Chrome. So another question that's usually asked are, um, are Firefox extensions safe? The short answer to that is yes, they are generally safe. You just have to make sure that you take the extra precautions um, when picking a extension. It's also recommended uh, that you pick add-ons with reviews and the ones that are featured just for safety as well so check the developer as well check the background of that developer just before you actually go around and downloading different uh, different extensions now third-party developers create the firefox extensions but most popular ones of course are subject to safety checks before mozilla accepts each new version so those are the ones that you can trust so now that we've covered the different questions on Firefox, we're gonna go ahead and get started with the actual SEO extensions that you can use on your browser. So starting off with our first one here, we have SEO Quick, and this is a fairly popular one. It's also very popular on the Chrome extension as well. This is actually a free SEO extension, and if you guys know SEMrush, they're the ones that have created this. And this helps you accelerate your SEO efforts, SEO Quick provides you with key SEO metrics for specific web pages and it also comes with other useful tools as well such as an SEO audit tool, an internal and external link uh, analysis and so on. There's just a bunch of different features and here are some of the ones that are featured. So you can get an analysis of the or you can analyze a web page uh, external and internal links. You can get a detailed information about the backlines. You can also do an SEO overview of any page. So this could be your website as well, just to double check and see if there's any issues. SEO Quick would be great for it. You can monitor the uh, pretty much the traffic and the ranking of the actual individual page. So this is the extension, as you can see, from the Firefox browser add-ons. And uh, if you do want to filter it out, you can do so. Uh, it's easy enough. It's just within the top here for the extensions. Anyway, as you can see that this is one, gonna be a trusted one as it is created by the SEO uh, Quake team. You can go ahead and check out the user themselves. As you can see that they started off at the 5th of March, 2007. So it can and will be a trustworthy uh, extension to use. Now they've got so far 18,531 users with a 4.4 rating out of 5 uh, for the Firefox extension. Now you get a solid background on this as well so if you just go through this there's a quick overview on it so 
Uh, you can review all major metrics in a heartbeat. As you can see, you could go through the SR, uh, SERPs as well. So that's a couple of the ones that I didn't cover there, which I did. Um, so as you can see, they do uh, consistently update it. So it was last updated within three months ago. So at the 22nd of December. And of course there are, you know, uh, a list of other stuffs as well. Uh, that you can check it out. You could also read the reviews if you wanted to as well. So there's a couple of good uh, reviews on it. So that's pretty much that. And uh, to download the SEO Quick SEO uh, extension, all you would need to do is just simply add to Firefox. Now you may, may get a redirection, especially since it'll ask me to add it on the top right here. So that'll add it on. And then I'm just going to go to my extensions here. So what I'll do is I'll actually take a screen grab of what I'm seeing now and basically just show you what the Google index is, the Bing index, and what uh, SEMrush is showing me as well. And I'll also compare it to other URLs so you can check out the backlinks and the traffic analysis and the parameters as well. So just a detailed overview. So you may have seen that on the actual browser itself. So it drops down from the top right when you select the puzzle piece or the extension. Now, as you can see, there's the Google index at 1.7 million. Um, you got the Bing index at 7.57 thousand or uh, 7.57K uh, and 70.4 million. So you could even see the uh, traffic flow as well and the ranking. Uh, and then Yandex there as well, which is uh, um, not available. So there's the domain, as you can see, that's where it's showing us the domain, then the bike links as well with the page. So depending if you're going onto a specific page, so we'll do one as well for Connolly Cove. We'll see what that pops up with. So this is an overview of Connolly Cove. So this is what we've got. So with internal links, we've got 58. External links, we've got seven. We can even see the server that it's running, which is uh, Cloudflare as well. We can see the meta description as well. Uh, we could see some of the keywords uh, that they, they use, which is mostly on travel, Ireland and Northern. So Northern Ireland, which, which makes sense. And we could see how many times uh, they've used that phrase and the actual wording. Uh, we can check a diagnosis uh, basically on the background. So we know that the URL is www.conleycove.com. And we could see the images, basically the text, the HTML ratio. So 21.41%, not bad. So it's saying that we suggest adding more text to your website. So that's some of the tips that uh, SEO Quick will give you now it's saying there that there is a warning so the micro formats the schema.org and let's see the amp as well so it seems that this page does not have an amp version if you're a publisher you should think about creating accelerated mobile pages so that's some of the four warnings as well now since we are running the free version um, well, this is free for the uh, thing anyway, so that which is good. You can also compare the URL to um, other URLs as well. So let's just say we compared it to profiletree.com. So these are our two companies. So profiletree.com and Conley Cove, and then we'll process the URLs. We can see the significant difference on the Google index, the Bing index, who is SEMrush ranks, and the SEMrush backlinks as well. You could even save that as well if you wanted to. Uh, there are some of the backlinks. So of course there are drastic changes with it, it as well. Uh, since this is now our, our new site, of course the Google index is going to be a little bit lower. Uh, so so we've got 21, uh, 2130 for that one. So as you can see, if you select that, you can even see the background of each of the, um, for the SEO quick uh, for each page. So that's what it's showing on how many, um, basically searches it's got. So there's a lot of, uh, 
there's a lot of things that you can do with the SEO Quick. It's a very great tool. I recommend you use it, especially if you're trying to gain traffic and ranking within your own business or you're just wanting to have a nosy at like other websites. You could do so using the SEO Quick. So hopefully that gives you a sort of insight onto some of the tools that we're looking for SEO. Uh, our next one here is the Foxy SEO tool. Now this is an exclusive add-on to Firefox, which provides a quick and easy access to a multitude of search engine functions, as well as web traffic analysis sites. So these being Alexa, SEMrush, and Compete. Now what is feature? This tool can check website listings in important directories, and then, uh, so yes, uh, this tool can check website listings in important directories. And then you can also, uh, you can find shortcuts to useful network functions and social media sites. So this is the Foxy SEO tool. So basically it's as is just go ahead and add that to Firefox. This is a quick overview on it as well. So it can show you, um, the search engines with Google, Bing, and others as well. Uh, so there's some of the stuff there. So if you are searching for a keyword, uh, you can search up a keyword within the site and it'll pop up how many there is. Um, it's got pretty much a very simple interface, but if, of course, if you don't mind the simplicity of the interface, you are purely just using it as an SEO tool, then it's very easy to do so. And it states there at the bottom uh, that it also supports a French localized version. So if you, I suppose if you're familiar with that language, um, then it can be very handy to use as well. Now, unfortunately, by the looks of things, it has been last update, uh, updated around six years ago at the 16th of January 2017. But we still are getting a four out of five rating for it. And we've got around 10 reviews. So recent ones are three years ago, as you could see, and some beforehand. But if it serves as a very handy uh, SEO tool, then by all means, go ahead and use it. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much the Foxy SEO tool. So our next one is the SEO analysis and website review by WooRank. Now, this is a free Firefox extension by WooRank. This provides a uh, review for any given website. And I think this would be great for anyone that is the, in the digital marketing industry or the S, um, for SEOs or web developers, bloggers, and so on. What exactly is featured for this? So provide several tips to improve your website rankings in Google and Bing. Now, this is fairly similar to the SEO Quick. So uh, for this one, we've got a... Uh, about 3,874 users with a 4.5 rating out of 5. And it's actually got 18 reviews. So if we scroll down and check the last update. So not too bad. It's been updated around two years ago at the 30th of December 2020. Now it gives you a quick overview as well on some of the extension uh, on what is included with the extension, which is usability, mobile friendliness, structured data, search engine optimization, so SEO, you got backlinks, social media, and traffic, website traffic. So all you would need to do is select add to Firefox and that'll add it in for you. And then we can open this up basically and get a insight on the actual website. So it's technically telling us that the add-ons Mozilla uh, or the actual web page that we're on is at around a 63 rating and it gives us the description as well so pretty much just uh goes by the same as well on our um on the actual let's say uh, it's the same pretty much as the seo quick if you could if you guys can see my screen so what i'll do is i'll actually take a screenshot of some of the parts that it shows me here. I'll actually do it for Conley Cove, see what happens for this. So hopefully we do get better ranking on this. So of course there are some errors we can pass. So take a look at this in a little bit more detail. Now it's just like the SEO quick. So basically for this one is 
it's saying that we may have to review uh, some some parts is outdated. So it does pass at a 67% rate out of 100. Um, we do have areas to improve on and there are a couple of errors. And of course, you can keep refreshing that and seeing the performance of the website. And it basically, if we did scroll down, it shows you basically the meta description, uh, the amount of clicks on, on each of the different browsers. Uh, so pretty much just like SEO Quick, it's a very, very good tool to use and I would highly recommend it. So uh, you can see the areas on page as well on what you can improve and uh, the impact and effort that's uh, into it as well. Uh, so yeah, that pretty much just sums up the use of the WooRank SEO analysis and website review. So we'll go ahead and move on to our next add-on. So our next one here is called Mangle's SEO extension. Now, this is an SEO extension that allows you to speed up your SEO within your browser. This extension provides an overview on the, all the key SEO metrics, popularity trends, backlinks, and on-page SEO insights of any domain or URL. Now, what exactly is featured? Keyword research, competitor analysis, backlink analysis, SER, SERP analysis, and rank, tranking, uh, rank tracking. So those are some of the uh, features of the actual Mangoes SEO extension. So this is how it presents itself. Uh, as you can see, we have a 3.5 rating uh, on this one with 1,176 users. It does say that some features may require payment as well. But if we take an insight to it, uh, works the same way as SEO Quick and the Woo rank. So you can see the amount of searches on keywords uh, to, towards uh, the following words there. You could check out the backlinks as well. The on-page SEO, so the SERP presence pretty much of the specific page. And you could also do some rank, trank, uh, rank tracking. And then, of course, this is the one that has to be paid for. Um, this is within a 10-day free trial. Uh, so that's the only unfortunate thing about using the Mangles. But of course, um, it does have quite a bit of features to it. So it would be worth a shot to go ahead and use. And you can e see as well that there is an Alexa rank. Uh, referring IPs and Facebook shares. And there's some of the backlink checkers that you could look as well. So there's the domain authority checker, broken links checker as well. So a couple of things that you can view over for your website. So this is this would be a great extension to use. But yes, folks, that is pretty much it for the SEO extensions. Now, those are some of the ones that I do trust. Uh, of course, there are other ones out there uh, that you can go ahead and view. So you're not just stuck to pretty much just what I've talked about and discussed. Of course, as I've said, there's other ones out there like SEO Minion. Uh, you got RF's SEO Toolbar. Um, SEO site tools, site analysis. But as I said, the only thing that you want to be careful of is just checking the background of that individual um, extension. You want to make sure that there's no um, hidden surprises. So pretty much just check the reviews, check how many people are using it, and also, yeah, just give a, a quick overview over each of the extensions. But anyway, folks, hopefully this video has helped. And of course, if there are any issues at all, please do let us know in the comments uh, section below. Uh, other than that, I'll see you guys for the next video. Thank you very much.